So heat number seven. And riders are up at tapes already. And uh, we've got Ty Wolfenden here who had a disappointing opening ride and needs to get amongst the points this time. But he's got gate three. Gate three is tough. So uh, Wolfenden are going to have to produce uh, something special now. So on the inside in red is Kim Nielsen. Gate number two in blue is Matsey Janowski. Gate three in white is Ty Wolfenden. Anders Thompson off the outside in yellow. Matsey Janowski and Ty Wolfenden have both won at this track. So they know what it takes. They've both struggled so far, you've got to say, in the Grand Prix series. And um, uh, certainly Wolfenden, after failing to score in his first ride, will be looking to get amongst the bigger points this time. So pressure on right from the get-go here. Takes her up and we're away. Nielsen's made a smashing start on the inside. Anders Thompson now gets across from the outside. Oh, is that outside going to work? It is! Anders Thompson, fabulous stuff from him, trusted the bike, didn't clamp down to the inside, and a bike fired him to the front. Janowski now coming through into third place with Ty Wolfenden trying to... Oh, oh Wolfenden's out of shape. Oh, he's all over the place, and Janowski's able to squeeze back up the inside of Wolfenden. But I tell you what, Anders Thompson, for the first time tonight, we've seen a rider get a little bit of extra grip off the mid-track part, and he got himself to the front, he's going to win a race. Yeah, we're seeing one or two riders now letting the uh, bike run around the first turn from gate four. It's just beginning to work now as Anders Thompson got the better of Kim Nielsen on the opening lap. You can see once again, look how tight Magic Janowski's riding. He's riding through gate two. That is not the fastest way around the track, and that is uh, having no confidence in the speed you've got under you. No, he's struggling there, and Ty Wolfenden, second time of asking. Failing to score, but for Anders Thompson, a return to form. That maximum last night in Poland certainly paying off there. Trusted himself, ripped around the outside in the first corner. Superb stuff from the Danish rider. Good to see. He had a nasty injury last year. He's taken his time to come back to form, but it's more like it for him. Three massive points for Thompson. Kim Nielsen, a handy second place for the Swedish rider, too. One point for Janowski, who was off the pace, and Ty Wolfenden. Zero points after two outings. That's concern there for their camp. They're going to have to get back to winning ways if they want to make the semi-final. But uh, for uh, Anders Thompson, this is a, a smashing first turn. Cracking first turn. He makes a decent start from gate four. Now he doesn't think, oh, I'm going to have to stop the run of Ty Wolfenden and Magic Janowski. He just thinks, OK, I'll let the bike run around the outside. Generates plenty of speed. Kim Nielsen riding quite defensively going into turn three. Leaves him all the room in the world. And within the space of a half a lap, uh, Anders Thompson's pulled himself a decent gap. And the battle then ensues at the back. This is the mistake. And Ty Wolfenden there just uh, turns the bike hard. He's made a tight entry into the corner. And then when the bike hooks up, he just goes across the corner. But uh, disappointment for those two at the back, really. And you consider both of them have won at this place in the Bergring Arena. Yes, it is a disappointing outcome, but some uh, work to be done, certainly for Wolfenden. Going to have to win his next two rides if he's going to make the semi-finals at all, give himself half a chance in his last qualifier. But Anders Thompson on five points. Wow, that's a, a fabulous way to bounce back. And when you consider they're both from the outside two gates, yeah, that's that is a, it's, it's a fabulous start. 